Today, we're diving into the top 20 hacking apps you need to know for 2026. This video is strictly for educational purposes. Think ethical hacking, not causing harm. We'll explore how your smartphone can become a powerful cybersecurity and penetration testing tool. From network scanners to full mobile pen testing platforms, we're covering it all. Whether you're a student, a network admin, or just curious, this list is for you. Let's jump in. Here are the 20 essential hacking apps for 2026. First up is Termux, the foundation for mobile hacking on Android. It's a terminal emulator and Linux environment, letting you run command line tools like Python, SSH, Git, and more right from your phone. Termux is the gateway to installing tools like Nmap and Metasploit, turning your device into a pocket-sized Linux machine. With simple package management and a huge community, it's a must-have for anyone serious about cybersecurity. Termux is the blank canvas for building your mobile hacking lab. Number two is Xanti, an all-in-one mobile penetration testing toolkit. Its user-friendly interface makes network diagnostics and vulnerability scanning accessible to everyone. Xanti maps networks, identifies devices, and tests for vulnerabilities, automating much of the recon process. It simulates real-world attacks like man-in-the-middle and session hijacking, showing you where your network is weak. For quick, comprehensive network audits, Xanti is a top-tier tool. Third is Hackode, a suite of reconnaissance tools bundled for ethical hackers and IT admins. It's a digital Swiss army knife for information gathering, Google hacking, HUIs, DNS lookups, port scanning, and more. Perfect for beginners, Hackode centralizes essential recon tools in one app. It's all about collecting public info before touching a target network. For convenience and learning, Hackode is a valuable starting point. At number four, we have Kali NetHunter, the mobile version of the legendary Kali Linux. It's a full penetration testing platform for Android, offering deep hardware integration for advanced attacks like HID keyboard and bad USB. NetHunter includes a full Kali Linux environment, giving you access to tools like Metasploit, Nmap, and Wireshark. It's the closest you'll get to a full pen testing laptop in your pocket. For sheer power and versatility, NetHunter is the king of mobile pen testing. If you want the ultimate mobile hacking setup, this is it. Number five is Wi-Fi Kill, a tool for network admins to monitor and control Wi-Fi devices. It scans your network and lets you disconnect unwanted users with a tap using ARP spoofing. It's a clear demonstration of how fragile network trust can be. Use it only on networks you own or manage. Misuse is illegal. For simple, effective network control, Wi-Fi Kill stands out. Next is Seasploit, an advanced open-source security toolkit for Android. It maps networks, finds vulnerabilities, and integrates Metasploit for launching exploits. Features include password sniffing, session hijacking, and DNS spoofing, all in one app. Its exploit finder saves time by matching vulnerabilities to known attacks. For deep network analysis and exploitation, Seasploit is a serious tool. Number 7 is DroidSheep a session hijacking tool that exposed the dangers of open Wi-Fi. It intercepts unencrypted session cookies, letting you access active logins on the same network. While HTTPS has limited its effectiveness, it's still a powerful educational tool. DroidSheep shows why encrypted connections are essential on public Wi-Fi. It's a classic example of real-world session hijacking. At 8, we have Nmap the industry standard for network discovery and security auditing. Run it via Termux or dedicated apps to scan networks, find open ports, and identify devices. Nmap's versatility makes it essential for both admins and ethical hackers. From quick scans to complex vulnerability checks, it's a foundational tool. Having Nmap on your phone means on-the-go network analysis is always possible. Number nine is Fing a user-friendly network scanner for quick diagnostics. It instantly lists all devices on your Wi-Fi, identifying type, vendor, and name. Fing also checks internet speed, open ports, and alerts you to new devices. It's perfect for home users and pros needing a fast network overview. For speed and accessibility, 
thing is a must-have. Tenth is AndroRat, an open-source Android remote administration tool. It demonstrates how malware can remotely control a device, accessing contacts, messages, and even the microphone. Security pros study AndroRat to understand and defend against these attacks. It's a stark reminder to be cautious with app permissions. AndroRat is a powerful, if unsettling, educational tool. Number 11 is Network Spoofer, a tool for demonstrating man-in-the-middle attacks. It lets you manipulate what others see on the same Wi-Fi, like flipping images or redirecting searches. While mostly for pranks, it visually shows how attackers can alter unencrypted traffic. It's a fun but effective way to teach the risks of public Wi-Fi. Network Spoofer makes network manipulation easy to understand. Twelfth is FaceSniff, another session hijacker focused on social media accounts. It made hijacking Facebook and Twitter sessions on open Wi-Fi shockingly simple. Encryption has reduced its impact, but it's a key lesson in why HTTPS matters. FaceSniff is a landmark in mobile hacking history. Understanding it is crucial for learning about session security. Thirteenth is Shark for Root, a mobile version of Wireshark for packet sniffing. It captures all network traffic on your device, saving it for deep analysis. Requires root access, but offers powerful troubleshooting and security insights. You can analyze app data, spot unencrypted traffic, or reverse engineer APIs. For serious network pros, Shark for Root is invaluable. Fourteenth is WPS Connect, targeting the vulnerable WPS feature on many routers. It scans for WPS-enabled networks and attempts to connect using default or weak pins. Use it to test your own router. If it gets in, disable WPS immediately. Many older routers are still at risk. WPS Connect is a focused tool for a well-known Wi-Fi flaw. Fifteenth is Wi-Fi UPS WPA Tester, a comprehensive Wi-Fi vulnerability checker. It color codes networks by security level and tests for WPS weaknesses using various algorithms. On rooted devices, it can even recover WPA passwords. It's a quick way to see if your network is vulnerable and needs WPS disabled. Don't assume a strong password is enough. Test your setup. Sixteenth is USB Cleaver, which targets physical access attacks. Plug your phone into a Windows PC and it silently extracts passwords and system info. It's a dramatic reminder. Physical access equals total access. Never leave your computer unattended or plug in unknown devices. For pen testers, it's a tool to demonstrate real-world risks. Seventeenth is DriveDroid. Turn your phone into a bootable USB drive. Store Linux ISOs, plug into any PC, and boot into a full pen testing environment. Great for running rescue disks or password reset tools on authorized systems. It's a huge convenience for IT pros and security testers. DriveDroid is a brilliantly clever utility for on-the-go work. 18th is the Kali NetHunter App Store, a dedicated repository for security tools. It's the safe, official source for apps like Termux, Nmap, and more, especially those not on Google Play. No root required for many tools, and it keeps everything up to date. Essential for anyone building a mobile security toolkit. The NetHunter App Store is your gateway to legit hacking apps. 19th is Packet Capture, a non-root packet sniffer for Android. It uses a local VPN to capture and analyze all network traffic SSL TLS encrypted data. Great for developers debugging apps or users checking what data is sent. The interface is clean and easy to use. For powerful, accessible packet analysis, packet capture is hard to beat. Last but not least, Orbot brings Tor anonymity to your Android device. Route all or selected app traffic through the Tor network for privacy and censorship bypass. It hides your IP and encrypts your traffic, protecting you on public Wi-Fi. Essential for researchers and anyone serious about digital privacy. Orbot is a fundamental tool for mobile self-defense. That's the list. 20 apps that turn your phone into a cybersecurity powerhouse. Remember, with great power comes great responsibility. Use these tools ethically and legally.
Understanding these apps helps you defend against real threats. Knowledge is your best defense. Use it wisely. If you enjoyed this deep dive, subscribe for more tech and cybersecurity content. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.